This is a big fit matchup. These two archers have gone head to head three times already in their career. In 2008, Brittany Ellison won the World Cup stage in Antalya. To Luke Darn got redemption in 2009 in Antalya, and most recently in Shanghai, the World Cup stage for the advantage to Tyler Dog. Off we go to target one. Ladies and gentlemen, representing the United States of America, ranked number one in World Cup points, Brady Ellison. <laughs> On target two, representing India, ranked fifth in World Cup points, Jayanta Tadadar. Nine. Right eight, right nine. Here you go. Ten. There you go, all Ten. day long. Then the X ring. Just out. Nine for Ray Ellison. That was it first issue. Good shot, Brady. Just out, let's pick up the pace. Two points 
and make it a score of three to one. First to six will win the match. And it is indeed scored 28 for Brady Ellison. Just right. Nine. Eight. Need to add. Eight. Be unconfident to think of. Tall. Ellison. Final arrow in eight. Ten. So in this next set, Brady Ellison needs to win it to keep this match alive. Five, four, three, nice shot. Nine on the line, might be scored as a 10 after the officials take a look. Nine. Great shot, keep that rhythm right there. Stand for quick. Okay, okay, take it. Time check. Ha! Final arrow. The Brady Ellison scores a nine. That was our final arrow. Eight. Twenty-five, twenty-eight unofficially advanced to Brady Ellison to keep the match alive. Thank you. Yeah. Come on, move it. Shake that body. Shake that body. So it's 29-10-10-9 for Ellison. Score of 25 for Tony Darn. Ellison in the same set of circumstances here. Needs to win the match, win the set, keep the match alive. But tie, he will concede the win to Tony Darn. 
tell a dog. No intention of doing this is a game. This is a very tight match for these two archers. We have seen some very, very strong battles here throughout the course of the weekend here. And this one, no different. The winner will advance to shoot for gold. Brady Ellison needs to win the set to keep the match alive. Nine. Easy and confident to team. Udhar hi jara. So. Nine. Kelly Dar with a nine. So is the center out of the Nine. Nine's across the board for Ellison. Ten to win for Kelly Dar. Oh, just outside the line. Too close to call from my vantage point. We're going to let that one rest to the calipers and uh, Judge Paul Neg. Actually, won't need the calipers. Just let us know if that one is indeed on the line. If it is touching the line, Kevin Dar will have the advantage and claim 10 points. Should they tie, they'll each pick up one point in the set, and that would be enough to clinch the match for India's Jayanta Kevin Dar. Paul Nang taking a very close look with a magnifying glass. It is scored. Nine. Nine, nine, eight. So it is indeed 27 26 advantage. Ellison, the match stays alive. So this got to be it right here. So now we are tied at 5 5 and in the shootout, ladies and gentlemen. This is as tight as they come. Have a hand for both of these world-class archers one more time. The winner will have a chance to shoot for gold. So this comes down to the calipers. Who is closest to the target? Closest to the center of the target will win the set and match. We watch your ball name. Hand signal to the target platform.